As April rolls around, the greatest golfers in the world will gather at Augusta again to battle for the great green jacket. Now, the green jacket was first introduced to Augusta in 1937 when it was given to the members so that the patrons coming to the Masters could identify the members. But the first time it was awarded to a winner of the championship was Sam Snead in 1949. It signified honorary membership to Augusta National. Now that has been awarded every year since. Now the rule is that the winner, the reigning champion, can keep it for one year and then must return it to Augusta National, never to leave the grounds again and only worn while you're on site. In addition to the green jacket, what a lot of people don't know is there's also a trophy. Now until 1942, the winner would receive a check and a three inch gold medal. But when Byron Nelson won in 1942, they designed a brass plaque on an oak panel and they gave that not only to Byron Nelson, but also retroactively back to all the previous winners. That trophy was used until 1960. And in 1960, they changed the format and introduced the new trophy, which is the clubhouse in silver relief on an oak panel. Beautifully tailored rendition of the clubhouse front. That was used until 1993, when the current 3D sterling silver trophy is presented to the winners. The first winner of that, of course, was Bernard Longer. First winner of the relief trophy was Arnold Palmer in 1960.